Hello everyone, Susie Gaming here and welcome back to another War Thunder episode. Today I'm gonna review 2S38, premium light tank, BR of 9.7, located in Soviet Tech 3. Now as you know, after all of that, IFV nerfs, developers now scared to release an OP vehicle, that's why they're releasing them with the high BR. And I think 2S38 suffered with the same situation here uh, you can purchase this with the golden eagles it costs 9000 this tank is very versatile and funny it's basically a russian puma the turret looks hot this is a three-man crew like an armata tank the crew is located at the front there you can see the same thing in german vt12 commander driver gunner sitting side by side at the front yeah this is a cool concept but we have no armor at the front so yes if enemy is dumb and it will shoot you at the turret you will survive but a direct hit to the frontal hull is either gonna ammo explode you because we have a lot of ammunition stored in the center of our build or all of your crew will just be wiped out so survivability wise it's not the best you might notice we have boxes at the side. Are those explosives armor? Unfortunately not. This is just structural steel. I uh, wish we had explosive armor like in Puma. This is basically base of BMP3. If you didn't notice. Useless. Absolutely useless guys. So this is a tank. You should not play as MBT. If you rush you'll die. You need to play supportive. Either flank. Take your time. Without being seen or spotted. Uh, this guy have bad torque. BMP2s are faster than this. It's quite a slow tank even though it's a light tank. So MBTs, wheeled vehicles, all of them will pass you. On the asphalt it goes normally 70 kph but off-road this thing is terrible. Such a small engine though, look at that. It's like a little battery engine. A square little battery. 500 horsepower. It's like a Tesla. <laughs> low fuel consumption but also bad horsepower. Whatever. That's the biggest minus about this vehicle. Turret is the real deal. We have 57 millimeter auto cannon and quite decent amount of ammunition types. We have APCBC for side shots. Uh, we have high explosives, not recommended to use it. We have dart rounds with penetration of 225. Proxy fuse shell, same as an American AA, M247 or Big Lit Panzer. Not only that, just like in AA, it tells you where to shoot. So it has guidance assist. You can use this thing as AA. Total ammunition amount is 148. Also, it warns if somebody is lasering us. Could be drone or helicopter. You can pop a bunch of smokes. We have scout drone. Uh, developers also added a new feature to the scout drone where it circles now. It has clear thermal vision. Uh, artillery ability of course, scouting ability, butt smoke, smoke grenades and interestingly dozer blades that you'll probably never use. It suffers from bad vertical guidance again, a soviet curse, minus 5. It has good reverse speed, minus 20. Top speed is 70, that's actually it. In the battles where I didn't die instantly, I managed to get between 6 and 8 kills. And at the end, I mostly died from the drones. As soon as I'm getting closer to nuke, bam, drone send an ATGM to me. So from now on, getting nukes at the top tier will be uh, quite hard because of this annoying drones. But yeah, it has same repair cost as in terms. I'll say it's an average tank, really situational. Of course, most of the newbies already purchased this blindly. When I was playing with this, I had a lot of defeats, guys. Looks like Soviet victory rate is ruined once more. You can see a bunch of this 2S38 now. Recently, we had Frogfoot. The amount of low level Soviets now at the 9.7 increased. I think it's peaked with T72, with Frogfoot. And this now. And of course BMP-2M as well. Four high tier Soviet vehicles that nobis can access now uh, directly. So yeah, be warned. In theory, this is an AA as well. Because it has guidance. Now, when did you last time see a premium AA? Why there is no premium AA, guys? Well, guys, here it is. We have it now. In all seriousness, I consider this as AA. Face-to-face -face tank combat-wise, it's worse than the terms. If you're being sneaky, flanking around, or you want to use this as a yay, this is your tank. That's it for today. I'll see you in the next one.